My name is Mike Smith. I am the GIS manager here at the City of San Angelo. And today I was going to go over the um, street view tool that we have included on this uh, public viewer. Uh, this is a nice tool to actually see some things that are on the ground. We've kind of incorporated some of the Google uh, street view maps in here and the Bing maps. Um, and so we'll go ahead and get started with this tool. So as you start this and you want to, maybe you're interested in a, in a certain area of town, um, it's best with this tool to probably zoom into to a street level where you can actually see a street uh, that you're interested in. And let's just say we want to go over here in this area by ASU. We're going to click this tool. And to begin with, it's going to pop up an initial box where you can actually, um, you've got some options you can choose from here. If you want to just see a dual viewer, if you want to see the Bing Maps, Google Maps, Street View only, or Street View with Google Maps. By default, it goes to dual viewer, and we're just going to leave it there. The second portion of this, you can actually open this up inside of Flash, and what that means is it's going to, it's going to put a box inside of this window. Um, some people may prefer that way. Others may rather have it open in a brand new browser. Uh, it's a little larger that way and easier to see. But by default, I'm going to keep these settings here uh, to open it in Flash. All I need to do is just click on any street segment. And it's going to start generating this view for us. And again, this is just a, a toolbox inside here. We can move this around. We can close it out. Right here it is showing me a street view. This is showing this map on the bottom is going to go show me which direction I'm looking. And here is a bird's eye view on this side. So in this street view, we can basically take the, I'm just clicking the map, holding down my mouse, and panning around and looking I'm in a circle. And you'll notice this map is changing. So is this map. So you have three different views here. You can move one of these maps. Say you want to look at a, an individual structure, possibly. Um, we can zoom out here on this map. Say you want to see this building here. This, this window's nice because you can actually, we're looking at it from, uh, from one direction. We can go around each side rotating the camera. We can look at this side of the building. So we're going all the way around the building to, to see the structure. So this is kind of nice when you're looking at some things. You can do the uh, aerial view where you can look straight down on it. Or you can do the bird's eye view, which is what we were in. And again, you're looking at the same thing here uh, back this direction on this building. You can maximize this um, if you have a large screen. If you really want to look at the street view, you can maximize this screen to get a full screen effect and actually um, kind of go down the road by double clicking. And you can kind of basically just walk down the street. And we can turn and look. And all the maps will change at the same time. To close this, we're just going to go ahead and get out of this. Uh, exit this and exit this, and we're out of the street view. Again, that's a basic run through of the Google Street View and some of the functionalities um, that, that you have at your fingertips with this, uh, this new viewer. If you have any questions, just call the GIS division at 325-657-4210.